In this video, we will create a second object, because a zoo with only one animal is a bit boring. Therefore, we add another animal to our program. Tap on the plus symbol in the main view. We go again to the media library, and there we pick the links. In the main view, you see that there are now two objects. Let's look at the program. Oh dear, we have two objects in our program, but unfortunately, they are on top of each other. Fortunately, we can change that pretty easy. Go back to the main view and tap on the links to get to the object view. One possibility to solve the problem of overlapping is to place the links on a different position on the screen. In other words, when the program starts, the links should be at a different position than the panda. Therefore, we first need the brick when program starts, which we find in the category Event. To change the position of the object, we need to go to the category Motion. In this category, there is a brick called Place at. Place this brick underneath when program started, and underneath place at, there's a x and a y with corresponding values. These values are underlined, which again means that they are changeable. But what do these values mean? For this, we need to make a short trip into mathematics to the so called coordinate system. A coordinate system has two axes a horizontal x-axis and a vertical y-axis. With this system, we can describe any point in a 2 day space with numbers. Let's see this with an example. How do we get to the drawn point? We always start in the middle of the coordinate system, the so-called origin. First, we need to go two steps into the x-direction and then we need to go three steps into the y direction. Hence, our point has the coordinates 2, 3. 2 for x and 3 for y. Let's try the same with this point. From the origin, we need to go 3 steps to the left and then 2 steps down. The point has the coordinates minus 3 and minus 2. Minus 3 for x since we went 3 steps left from the region and minus 2 for y since we went down from the region. This principle also works in pocket code. We have a coordinate system and as a standard every object is placed in the region when it's created. Notice that one step here is way smaller than before because one step is only a pixel. If we want to place our links differently we need to change its coordinates. We want to place it directly above our first object. So which coordinates do we need? Tap on the values to get to the formula editor. Change the x value to 0 and the y value to 600. Tap on OK to save the change. If we test the program now, we see that the links is placed above the panda. To see the coordinate system, tap on back and in the control panel there is an option called axis on. For x we had the value 0 and for y 600. So the object only moved on the y axis. To work with coordinates is very important since we need it quite often later on. Now we can add many more brick star links to give it a cool behavior. But this is gonna be your task.